With mainstream auto manufacturers like Mazda and Toyota investing in their ICE technology, it's not surprising to hear there are still companies looking to prolong the combustion engine. Astron Aerospace is in the business of making combustible fuel engines greener for the planet. First introduced as the Omega-1, the cutting-edge engine has been further refined into the H-2 Starfire engine. The H-2 Starfire's first noticeable advantage over the Omega-1 is its reduced part count. The team cut out excess pieces, starting with 114 parts trimmed to the resultant 82 parts found on the H-2 Starfire. Even better, the Starfire engine runs entirely on water and hydrogen. While some manufacturers are researching and developing ways to utilize the fuel in the current piston-configured internal combustion engines, Astron Aerospace created a new engine for the fuel. The H2 Starfire makes use exclusively of hydrogen fuel in hopes of having only water vapor as a byproduct when combusted. A single H2 engine weights 120 pounds, produces 400 horsepower and 500 pound-feet of torque. It also measures at a hobbit-sized 11.4 by 12.5 by 17.3 inches, small enough to fit into a Japanese K-car while making as much horsepower as a 2024 Nissan Z. With fewer moving parts than a piston engine and fewer parts than its older sibling, the Omega-1. The H2 Starfire makes its functions simpler while producing enormous power per pound. Astron Aerospace sees a different player in powering our lives while adhering to a greener future. They believe the H2 Starfire technology can serve as the most versatile powerhouse for almost any application. And they claim the Starfire will do it at a quarter of the cost of fuel cells or electric car batteries. The H2 Starfire's low weight of 120 pounds and compact size make it a great fit for many applications. Astron Aerospace has proposed this compact engine could power generators, be utilized in agriculture, lawnmowers, power tools, marine applications, automotive and drone applications. The H2 Starfire engine is currently a running prototype and has been teased on YouTube by Astron Aerospace running on what we can only assume is a canister of hydrogen.